in, in college. I want to transition to college and the women's tournament that's going to be on the way. Uh, by this time next week, they'll, they'll be getting started. And uh, it's been a fun race in, in the Pac-12, if you've talked about for, for some time. Uh, the women have really been, been hooping this year. Uh, it's going to lead to some fun matchups as I pull this up. Uh, the bracket, uh, I don't know if this is fully stamped as it, but it's on the Pac-12 website. Uh, so I think there might be some fluctuation over the next couple of days as some games are continuing to be played. Um, but if this is set, uh, it makes for a very fun Pac-12 tournament. Uh, we're going to we may potentially get a USC UCLA matchup as USC at the bottom of, of, of the of the bracket there. And do you think one of them can can go all the way and win, win the tourney, or do you think one of the other squads will will end up being victorious? Uh, I'll tell you as as you look in and as you both are scanning through what's going Just, on here. Uh... Strict, strictly Pac-12 you're talking? Pac-12. This is the Pac-12 yeah. one. Yeah, we'll, we'll stay right here. Yeah, I mean, we've talked about it. it it's been a bloodbath at, at the top of this Pac-12, too. They got, what, six teams in the top 25? Yeah. Uh, um. So it's I, – I don't think it's a foregone conclusion that it's just USC or UCLA. Like, Utah is giving them fits. Uh, as you've mentioned, Colorado at times is giving them fits. Mm -hmm. uh, Arizona has been on a run themselves um stanford of course uh, has been great so yeah i mean juju of course is is probably the star of the tournament you got cameron mm -hmm. brink at, at stanford as well but juju is the name in college basketball after kaylin clark so yeah. you probably favored them a bit uh and, and then ucla too has been really uh great as well as a collective uh, um so i mean i guess it's just with the LA bias, I'll, I'll, I'll roll with Juju because uh, she's been really fun and exciting to watch. I'll, I'll, I'll roll with them. Hold on, the hold on, hold on. Because you, you keep doing that. You're the UCLA guy. You pick USC a lot in this. I appreciate you seeing. I, I, I hate this. I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't give love to no, another no, 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 no. Hold on. California Let me get team. I appreciate Ridiculous. you seeing the town we have on, on the right side of town and what, what's going on here. A a Bruin, I don't know how Bruins fans watch the show and can be support and can like what you keep doing over here. You pick USC <laughs> a lot. That's all I don't, I'm it, doesn't, it doesn't have to be a nasty rivalry, man. Like it, it's a rivalry, yes, but like I respect greatness when I see greatness, man. Like that, that's all it is. You got there's levels though. There's at certain <laughs> points you gotta say, yes, there's greatness, but my team's playing great too. UCLA's playing great. Don't get me started. Depending yeah, on but I don't, I don't have to got. I don't have to pick my team just because it's my team. Like I, I can be I can be <laughs> I'm objective. Saying you don't pick them a whole lot. You pick USC a lot. <laughs> Go ahead and put the red on, man. It's all right. You know what the, <laughs> right, the right side is. So, Never yeah, that. Never uh, that. Uh, allow me to say it. USC and Juju are gonna cook. I'm looking forward to the matchup. Hopefully we see y'all in, in the, uh, what would that be? The semifinals next Saturday. We'll have a reaction for you guys and you will talk about it once that goes down. And yeah, Juju's going to do her thing. I'm excited to see her play. And as the USC guy of the group, definitely want, want them to are, go are, far. Are you, you going to make me hate? Are you gonna make me hate? Is this That's what I've been trying to get you to hate. All right, hopefully we get another. Hopefully we get another ten for thirty from Juju again. All right, there there another generational shot chuck in after last day. All right, you want me to hate? I can hate. Yes. There it is. There it is. I was just talking about Peyton Watson. I wasn't talking about this guy later though. I was. I was talking about Peyton Watson. Get his ass back. I was talking about him in the NBA. Get his ass. We're not talking about him compared to USC. Think of it. Comes to you compared to USC. Into the conversation, so yeah, Genera don't, don't generational flip flopper. <laughs> what, whatever, whatever. Noel, your, your thoughts on the Pac 12 as already we, we discussed it. Uh, which of the kind of uh, uh, the SC squad, USC, UCLA, you see going further? Yeah, I really hope we see that, that semifinals matchup. That'll be so that'll be amazing for the city. I think both both the teams they've been doing their thing this year and they've really been putting on. I think specifically looking at UCLA, they've they have a really good group dynamic going on when it comes to getting around playing team defense, getting out in transition, sharing the the amount of shot attempts. And then USC, I mean, Juju Watkins, she's, she's just a hooper. She yeah, is a hooper. Yeah. And, I mean, like, she got a lot of hate for the recent things, people saying that she's shooting tour dates out there. But <laughs> to command that respect and to be able to keep shooting all of those shots, you, you got to respect it. I mean, we're all Kobe fans here. And that, that dude, he never saw a shot that he didn't like. Juju, mm -hmm. from such a young age, she's already – kind of in that sense where she she truly believes she can make every single shot that she takes. And, you know, I think the majority of the time they're winning the games when she's shooting a lot. She has USC in a really, really good place. And her teammates trust her. You know, they're getting the ball to her. They're trying to set her up in good spots. Obviously, when you get into the Pac-12 tournament, more game planning goes into play. The game slows down as a whole. So I don't expect to see another 30, 30 attempt shot game, but I do think she's going to do her thing. And, I mean, I'm excited for both teams, man. They, they're, they, they match up really well together. They do. Uh, they're crazy. wild in the season, right? 
What was that? One and one. one and one on the season. Yeah, yeah, they're one and one on the season, so they could settle it right here. That would be awesome. One and one. Hopefully, UCLA does their job and gets to the semifinals. We see them in the in, in there, have a good game. And, yeah, looking forward to how all that plays out. So, going to be a fun one. Wanted to react to it. Uh, we talked a whole lot about the two squads, USC and UCLA, in there. As you already noted, Alec, I will add in real quick, too. Yeah, just about the other squads in there. Colorado been playing uh, at a great level. Has upset uh, a couple of our squads as well. Stanford, I think, is are still sitting at. Are they number one in the nation right now? Or they're sitting, they're sitting uh, high in the standards. They're, they're above USC. Not one. They're probably top three. Or, yeah. yeah, they're top three. Excuse me. Uh, as, as South Carolina other squads are, are rolling. But Stanford is sitting at uh, one in our conference for sure and playing at, at a great level. So a lot of good pieces there, as already noted. And, yeah, looking really looking forward to this tourney as it's going to get underway in the next week. So uh, no, good no, step no. with them. Uh, not a whole lot on the men's side just yet. They're in the middle week after that, so we'll have a preview of that tournament once it's a little bit closer. But, yeah, good one on the women's side and excited for all of that's on the way. So, yeah, with that, as we say at the end of each segment, appreciate you tuning into this part. Make sure you show love to LA Sports Report. A lot of good stuff going on on that page. Make sure you're tuned in and subscribe to the channel on YouTube. And, yeah, a lot of, a lot of fun uh, continuing on from here. So, uh, good stuff in that regard. Uh, going on beyond LA.